are finished, Cobblepot. No, I'm sorry. Please, don't hurt me. I can't guarantee that. <laughs> me neither. <laughs> I tried to help you, Batman. I gave you the opportunity to end this and walk away, but oh no. You had to be the big man. Well, guess what? From up here, you look pretty small. Oh, don't look so sad. I've got a little surprise for you down there. down there when I bought this place. <laughs> Comes in handy. See how much that ugly son of a bitch can take! Kill that bastard! Yes. <laughs> 
stuff with the bloody explosives! I mean it! Just you and me left. The bat versus the bird. Stay still, Batman. Cobblepot. Well, look who it is, Mr. Fria. <laughs> Enough. Freeze. Enough. Of course. You will regret what you did, Mr. Cobblepot. Your freeze. There isn't one. What? Perhaps I should elaborate. Creating an antidote to the disease that afflicts the clown was easy. Unfortunately, the cure degrades too quickly. It needs a restorative element, some kind of reforming enzyme. Without it, it breaks down before it can help its host. I've seen this before. Finding a suitable enzyme is not the only problem. It needs to be adapted, bonded to human DNA. That will take decades. Time, it appears, you do not have. What if I told you I know a man who's been exposed to that enzyme for centuries? What man? His name is Raish al Ghul. Bring him to me. All I need is a sample of his blood. It is your only hope. Raish al Ghul is dead. Then you and the clown are doomed. Not exactly. I need someone to tell me where the body is. Then I can go wake him up. Blasphemer! You are not worthy to speak of the great racial ghoul! You are a fool, Batman. You've let your only hope escape. No, Victor. If Rachel Ghoul is in Arkham City, I now have a trail right to him. <laughs>